So the Diablo 4 campfire chat was earlier today. Today I give you guys my rundown of thoughts on it. And also guys, we're going to check out the latest hotfix, which is coming later today. How's it going guys? My name is DPJ and if you do enjoy the video, leaving a like really helps out. And if you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. So the Diablo 4 campfire chat was earlier today. And to be honest, it's exactly what I wanted to see for this game. The devs clearly understood that the patch was wrongly timed and included things that were a little harsh. They made it clear that this kind of patch won't ever happen again. They explained with decent reasoning on why certain changes were put in place and it mostly made sense. Also how they will act upon what's happened to improve such. They spoke about great changes to come too, including XP, faster leveling to 100 from 50, which is a great, great change, cheaper respects, quality of life improvements like gems becoming a material, extra stash base, which is something we all want, a multitude of changes to bring a much bigger build diversity across each class, buffs to certain aspects for all classes, but firstly they're going to concentrate on the sorcerer and barbarian, substantial changes to enemy density in nightmare dungeons and hell tides. These dungeon changes actually come later on today in a hot fix, but we'll talk about that in a quick second. But other things they spoke about as well as the leaderboards, uber uniques eventually becoming more common and a few other bits and bobs. Now it's clear to me they know uh, they took a massive hit with the latest patch and I feel it's something they truly understand the effects it had on the player base and will work for it to never happen again. Now we do get a new patch, the 1.1.1 patch coming in a couple of weeks but next Friday we get another campfire chat looking more into that 1.1.1 patch now overall i was quite happy with the stream i'm not gonna lie two years definitely what i expected there was less backtracking than what i expected you could see as soon as that stream started they seemed a little like anxious worried how people would probably take it but i think it was, overall it was a decent I, I don't know what people were expecting i saw people hating on it but what were people expecting obviously we all wanted that patch to be reverted but that was just never gonna happen i believe what they said and what they described that made things clear and they understood that the effects that the patch had on the game and they also made it clear as well their intentions in this patch and for sure it was good enough for me okay so the hotfix they've just dropped details on the actual notes for this hotfix uh we'll get into it straight away hotfix 3 this hotfix is not yet deployed and will be updated later this evening once it's been released with additional fixes now at the minute this is what we have gameplay update we are implementing a reduction to overall monster power levels in Nightmare Dungeons. The new top range for tier 100 will feel like what tier 70 was previously. Developer note, although these values make it appear that the higher tiers are easier than lower tiers, this is not the case because the monsters also benefit from being significantly higher uh, in level than the players in these higher Nightmare Dungeon tiers. Examples they give, a tier 35. HP reduced by 2%, damage reduced by 1%, tier 50, HP reduced by 20%, damage reduced by 13%, tier 70, HP reduced by 60%, damage reduced by 54%, and tier 100, HP reduced by 82% and damage reduced by 79%. Okay, so that is a hot fix on what we have on it now it does say this will be updated later on today now i'll link this hotfix down below within that video description if you do want to check it out uh, later on it's almost half one in the morning now here in the uk so we definitely won't have time to update uh, you guys on this until tomorrow so yes keep an eye out on the link in the video description for any further updates but there we have it guys guys if you enjoyed the video leaving a like really helps out if you like what you see and want to see more be sure to subscribe and hopefully guys i will see you on that next one.